I'm here. Now I'm looking for Jules Muck, awesome street artist that I met last night walking down Abbot Kinney. I paint a lot of murals, but sometimes I do these garbage bombing things. Hey, hey hello. I live here and work here. Best way to go because there's no parking. I'll make parking. Lucky Excuse dog. me, I'm about to give birth. <laughs> Hopping in the trunk here for this adventure. This is cozy. Hi! Bye. <laughs> is this a one-way street? Is this a spot? Great. We were just about to walk up. I do a lot of murals around town. I have leftover paint sometimes and I have spare time. So I do like public artworks, make things easier on the eyes. I ride to the beach every morning like 6 a.m. and I pass this van. And this van looks terrible. Like it's got like the worst scratch tagging. Yeah, so I, I left her a note and I was like, I'll Paint your van for free, just call me. So she did. Awesome, that's yeah. so cool. That's the van? I can, oh wow. Wow, that's a lot, there's a lot of work to be done. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's a doozy. Oh yeah, yeah you yeah. paint everything? I paint everything. Oh, Chihuahua. Oh, yeah, just... Different color or the same color? All oh, different, don't paint here, okay? Please. No, no. Every has the one with the brushes of this. And here we have I'm wondering how much of this we can even cover with spray paint, so I'm gonna prep it with house paint. That's right. Since like um I think I came here in 2007 from New York. I've been more comfortable here than anywhere in the world. It feels so right. That's my guideline. Dark stuff will show through the spray paint, so I gotta kind of prep it a little. But I'm gonna leave the window that's clean so he could see to park. The trick is like you actually have to cover up all the tags or they come back and do more tags. Come back every day for a year and recover the tags, eventually they stop. <laughs> I'm gonna spray paint most of it, I'm just prepping some stuff. The project last night was pretty fun. Painted it and I was like, we need to like really install this one. Um, so how often do you- No, you it's know. like half an hour. To paint it. Yeah, yeah. Whoa. You make these things. How often oh, do you like put them every up? day, every day. Every day. Yeah, you gotta see the Instagram. They're so funny. Muck rock. Yeah. Oh, I love that. <laughs> what do you have in mind? Well, it's kind of a secret. Oh, I like that. Because <laughs> I like to see when you can guess. Yeah, so far I'm thinking hamburger of graffiti hamburger. <laughs> <laughs> but I know you have to cover all of it. So well, that's pretty close. No one's gonna like put it in a museum, you know, make sure that it's okay because they didn't pay for it and that's how people value stuff. It'll actually affect way more people than any piece that gets Ooh. bought in a gallery because it's not gonna be, it's gonna be like out here on the street. Everyone who passes by gets to enjoy it. Though it's like monetary value is nil, it's actual value supersedes that. Yeah, yeah. Because for me, this is my favorite part. Well, Painting. Exactly. exactly. <laughs> One layer of primer, some kind of second layer, gas mask. This van has been here for months, and she got permission from the owner. We don't know what she's painting yet. She wants it to be a mystery, try to figure out what she's doing as she goes. Oh wait, is it actually a burger though? So we figured it out. Looks like it's gonna be a burger of some kind. I first guessed it was, I thought, graffiti burger maybe? But all the graffiti is gonna be covered um, so they don't come back and tag it again. Let's see what kind of burger it turns out to be. burger van is taking shape. It's gonna be a really cool van. <laughs> it looks good. I wish we could do that with our car. Exactly, <laughs> right? To 
tomato, we have lettuce, we have cheese. She's very active on Instagram. Her username is muckrock on Instagram. Various photographs. Do the fumes like get to you or is it like, does the mask really help? It's supposed to. It's supposed I can, to. I, I mean, I don't wear it when a lot of the time, but when I'm doing like that high pressure. Yeah, yeah. It just goes everywhere, so it's good to wear it. This is a skinny cap on a low pressure can. The cheese layer is where it's at. <laughs> Put a cheese coating on anything and you're golden. It's a little cheesy, but it's a little... <laughs> <laughs> okay, awesome. Thank you very much. I love like all the people this attracts. Like people are walking by. People know Jules just from the neighborhood, and they're like, "Awesome, man!" This is a burger mobile. It's the burger mobile, exactly. Oh, yeah. Is it like a face? That's amazing. Well, we thought it was just a normal burger, but then some kind of eyes forming here. Blue eyes, blue eyes. The burger version of me as a car. <laughs> Unexpected twist in this in this art adventure. Jules Muck in her element. Now we have a whole nother level here. Ants appearing oh. on the top bun here. You don't like ants in your burger? <laughs> People walking by were getting hungry. Makes so me hungry. I want to go to in. I want to go to in and out. <laughs> and we needed to say <laughs> exactly. We needed to stop that. So Jules put some uh, some ants on there. <laughs> <laughs> People have been repeatedly stopping, recognize her. The label's taking shape. Eat muck. Oh, eat muck. Oh. Yes! The final piece to the burger. It's looking great. Uh, it's now finished. Looks amazing. Got to see the whole process from start to finish. It's amazing how much it changed, evolved so much. So any final thoughts about what you have created here? Oh, I'm stoked. Super happy with it. Yeah, it was a little like improv. Nice, that's yeah, awesome. Yeah, you never know. The van has been painted. How long did that take? Like two hours? I made a van into a burger. Like the couch, but a van. Oh, the burger couch. Well, now there's a van. You'll see. I know, Wait. that's what I was thinking. Haas, Cameron, ah, Julia, yeah, I Shannon. Want, I want those shoes. I, I know. <laughs> if you want to give her any of my info, you're welcome. All right, see you later. Thank you. Yeah, I, I feel that it was pretty successful, the mission. <laughs> <sighs> Jules was just saying how a few of her murals are pokey stops, so people are stopping at uh, her murals and you know what getting some Pokemon. Is. Great meeting Bye. you. Bye. Have nice a good one. Bye. 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 Jules Muck in action in Venice, painting a burger on a van. That was so cool. That van was notoriously kind of run down, and she went and painted this awesome painting for it. Selfie video in Venice, only in Venice. It was awesome meeting Jules. People were like stopping in the streets and saying like, hey, I know you, and I think that's awesome work she's doing. Venice is awesome, street art is awesome. <laughs> Apparently she has murals all around here. I probably have seen her murals before. First it was just like a burger, <laughs> and then it turned into like there was eyeballs on it, and then ants on it. It was just cool to see that come together. The creative process, Venice Beach, 2016. So yeah, go check out Jules Muck, all the links are below. You know, you can't take things too seriously. Like <laughs>